for me, being at RISD is being at home. People say uh, sometimes to me on the beach this summer, are you still teaching? And I always say, stop using the word still. When I first came to RISD, I felt I was really doing something by getting students to read, getting them to write with a pen on a piece of paper. And I can remember the handwriting of my early students. But a student of mine this summer, who just graduated recently, came to visit me. And she said that I didn't force them to read. And that made her read more willingly. She said she had never been a good reader. So as the liberal arts division and as the departments within it begin to try to encourage a more intense interest in the liberal wing, it's the biggest part of RISD in terms of the numbers of faculty. Uh, my problems and my achievements, I think, have to do with the fact that I like a little smile, a little smirk when it comes to books and when it comes to even words. I teach film classes and have for a long time. I do think that it's a, a very good subject matter to teach within the liberal arts at RISD because you have set design, which might appeal to an architect. You have costume design, which might appeal to the apparel majors. Uh, you have, obviously, cinematography, which might appeal to photographers. But sometimes a great film, a subtle and ironic and worthwhile film, uh, can be looked at, can be broken up and reconstructed from so many points of view that I never run out of things to say. I can watch the same older film over and over again, like drinking your favorite wine. And I often compare film to wine. It go, you go to my head like the bubbles in a glass of champagne. If you recognize when a certain scene contributes to the totality of the theme of a movie, a certain performance that's perhaps not Marlon Brando hollering, but a very slight gesture, Hoagie Carmichael playing a little tune with his bony knuckles showing in a scene, a camera angle. Uh, it, within the context of a moment of historical time, the courage that's perhaps shown. For me, movies are a great way to teach writing as well as perception in general. I'm a believer in metaphorical thinking, and I'm a believer in the fact that the less you control your thinking, the better off you are because if you don't have a sense of the absurd, if you lose your sense of humor and start using bigger words and fancier references, you're going to lose your soul. Le génie, c'est l'enfance retrouvée à volonté, which means genius is the ability to remember your childhood by the exertion of your will. Somebody asked me while I was canoeing with them the other day if I was happy. And I said, well, you know, the pursuit of happiness is guaranteed in our constitution. But I said, it's the pursuit of happiness. And I said, you know, nobody's entirely happy. I said, but yes, I think I found happiness. I think I've always been happy at RISD. I don't think there's been a day when I haven't found a little sunbeam of joy uh, because I think this is a blessed place. That may sound, uh, you know, corny and sentimental, but it is how I feel.